And welcome back to AM Buffalo. I'm so excited. Get it? No, no. <laughs> Stop joking around. I, oh, <laughs> I like oh, it. You want to go back I and forth? Like I like it. A lot of Listen, <laughs> you can you can beat me at that any day, I'm sure. But eggs are one of the hottest and most nutritious mm -hmm. treats mm -hmm. yes, in town they are. or anywhere. Yes. Yes. We're just so excited to have Jeanette Creer Everling here in studio yes. because it's been so long. It has been three and, years almost. Oh my goodness! Yes. But you know stepping in to make some eggs or an egg dish for us. This is no small thing. And I have to say, this is adorable. Yeah. They are so cute. And this is a great so thing to do with your kids. Mm -hmm. yes. So I know a lot of my segments recently have been about kids. Mm -hmm. A little shout out to Roy Hart. I did a, a, with their green team, I came and we did an egg experiment and we talked about mm -hmm. eggs and we made deviled eggs and we made a couple different kinds. So you don't have to just do the traditional. We made a, um, potato bacon cheddar ranch oh goodness so me. we put all those things into the filling mm -hmm. and they ate them up like hotcakes oh i'm sure so you can have some fun with it absolutely one of the biggest things about eggs not only are they delicious but they are very nutritious they are they are and eggland's best have a special diet that the chickens are fed so they have more vitamin d vitamin e vitamin b all good things for your body so mm -hmm. Eglin's Best Eggs have higher of all the things your body needs, except for vitamin C, because there is no vitamin C in any egg. But you said don't skip the yolk, though. Don't skip the yolk. You can't skip the yolk. And then for the vitamin C, you just need to add the orange juice. Ooh. Yeah. And then and your you body know, has everything. And it's, it, I mean, there's, this is a little bit of sunshine right here. That's all I have oh, to say. I mean. They're my little with, balls of sunshine, all that vitamin yes. C. <laughs> I, I have to make mention of you or what you brought with you. She said so here, funny. look at this, naughty chickens lay deviled eggs. So let's get into it. I love that. I love that. I love that. So the, the vegetable slicer isn't only for slicing vegetables, it's for making the shell of these cute little oh chicks. Oh my gosh, that's it's neat. perfect. That's neat. So you just go around the egg and then you pop the yolk out and then it, give it a little squeeze. I have it going into a bag because mm -hmm. I have a little fun trick to show and it's oh. great for kids. So to that we're going to just add some um, garlic and salt okay mm -hmm. and some Love mustard garlic. so mustard is something we put into our eggs we like the must the flavor of mustard it gives it a little tang mm -hmm. i like you it. can also do um lemon juice if you want it sure. instead if you don't like mustard you can't really taste it and then the um mayo mm -hmm. so the next thing you do is if you put it into a bag now i don't have the right amount of yolks in here you just squeeze it and That's the kids neat. can play with it. Can play with it, no mess. <laughs> exactly. It's so satisfying. And yes. In, in the kids, I had 20 students and they loved it. They all had to, five times to squeeze the bag and get it ready so that we could put it and into it's the- And right in the piping bag. It's yes. perfect. I and love then it. what you do is you get all the air out, you take the corner, you give it a little snip, and then you fill the eggs. Love it. So to these great th eggs, we can either make hard boiled eggs ourselves or mm -hmm. we can buy these convenient packed eggs I already. This. Mm -hmm. So if you have a smaller group, I would suggest that because then you'll yeah. have a good peel all the time. Another little secret, buy your eggs early. Fresh eggs don't peel right. I have heard that. Yes. Oh, yes. So, so our eggs go to market really, yes, okay. really fast. And Eglin's Best have extra um, dot things in the diet to make the shell hard. Mm -hmm. So it makes it even harder to make a hard cooked egg. And, and that's important because yes. I'm sure Easter is one of the times of the year where you sell the most. It is our busiest, shortest period. Mm -hmm. The other one is, <laughs> is Chris Thanksgiving to Christmas. Yeah. So yeah. that's a longer period and people are usually baking and that, you know, brunch and sure. all that kind of, of, of uh, entertainment. This is mostly deviled eggs yep. or Easter eggs for the Easter baskets. So my suggestion is buy them about two weeks in advance, mm, that's keep good. them in the middle of the fridge where the temperature stays constant and just forget about them. Yes. Then pull them out and you should have good peeling eggs. That's yes, really they just point. come yes. right off. Yep. Is there is there any truth to putting the uh, baking soda in the water or anything like that? So eggs are porous. Mm -hmm. So if you put vinegar or baking soda, they tend to have that taste if you're very sensitive to palate. So, so don't I, necessarily give in to all those. I don't do that because I can taste it. Oof. Yes. Okay. Yes. And I then, have to show this little chicky. <laughs> the eyes are black olives, right? Yes, black olives. You take a straw and you cut the black olives out and they become the perfect size. Mm -hmm. The and noses have, are carrots. Oh, there, there you go. So I have feet and noses that are carrots. Love it. And I also saw that you could do it with um, uh, peppers. So 
you can add your vegetables into mm -hmm. your nutritious eggs. Awesome. Oh my gosh. Thank you so Such much. This great, is great tips. This is great. Jeanette, anytime. Yes. Come on back. Yes. We can we love eggs. We love you. So yes. make sure you uh, don't be a stranger. Oh, I won't. I won't. Thank you for having me back. Oh, it's so great. And you, after the break, <laughs> stick around with us because we have while Mercedes is eating, we're yep. gonna get ready with Kelly Springer.